Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be doing a review of the Lux Player and SO Player. I'm going to do a side-by-side -side comparison and see the difference between the two players. And if you want to try and use the new Lux Player uh, on your Android device. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, launch the apps and uh, get logged in and we'll kind of go, we'll go through some of the layout and functionalities that they both have to offer. Obviously, depending on the, the service provider you use, you may have some different channel lineups and things like that, but we're just reviewing the player and the layout. So right off the bat, uh, logging in to the Lux player and the SO player, you can see that the layout and interface is pretty much exactly the same. Obviously, based on the provider you use, you're going to have maybe a few other options on the top menu. But as far as your home, live, EPG guide, and movies, they seem pretty much exactly the same. There's not much of a difference between the two players. Um, their interface is pretty much like for like. The one thing I do notice, the Lux player shows you the latest added movies and series in their main home menu versus the SO player only shows you your recently watched. So that is the only difference I've noticed between the two players. So if you want to try the Lux player, you're not going to notice any difference if you've used the SO player. Thank you.